time to begin the stuff and the things. Hello everyone and welcome to episode 5 of Stuff and Things. You may be wondering why we have a Donkey Kong amiibo on our little companion cube, and that is because Harambe the Gorilla was shot and murdered. I do not think that's what the movie was about. That actually sounds pretty nice. Anyway, to mourn the tragic loss of this gorilla, and because there's a nice fume truck outside, we've decided to hold the rest of this video outside. Yes, I do believe there is an ice cream truck. Yes, such person, you can carry the rest of applesauce outside. And now we are outside to do the rest of the report. All right, so what should we do? Hmm, let's see. Should we do the report where Betty White is killing all those people? Alrighty then, bring up Betty White's picture on the iPad so we can start, get started. Wait, what? Wait, the iPad's not out here? I, I don't understand, where's the iPad? How are we gonna do pictures and special effects and stuff if we don't have the iPad? We don't, we can't afford the special effects applications or whatever. Well, th this is serious. Well then, say it, sock person! <clears throat> okay, this was a really big mistake. I mean, what was I thinking outside? Look at this! Seriously, I mean, the Holocaust happened outside. 9-11 happened outside. Why did I decide to go outside? Only one of those two things were worth it! Okay, we are going back inside, back at the nice safe house, right now! Alright, I finally made it to the door. Had to drag the blanket to get you guys out of the horrifying grassy area. But, at the very least, we're somewhat safe now. Now all I need to do is go up to the block. And... What the heck?! I can see that the doors are locked, but why are they locked? Who locked them? Sock person, just what in the crap is a plot device? Well, I guess that explains why that hedgehog was able to bust into the building like that. But how are we gonna get in? Um, okay, we just have to camp out here until then. I mean, what's the worst that could happen?
Hello everyone, it is about 8.30 at night now, about five hours or so since we started outside, and I've got to say, it is a nightmare. I honestly have no idea how I'm alive. I had to fight off eight raccoons with a piece of tree bark and a piece of grass. At this point, I consider myself lucky to be alive, and I hope to God that the worst is behind us. I really hope that I didn't just trigger some horrifying event by saying those words. There's a dragon standing there, isn't there? Rawr. Double rawr. Well, we're screwed. Well, look at it this way. One of us are vegan, so you'll get less eaten. Well, Pydra, you're a dead man. W wait a second, I'm a Hydra. How could I be dead? Ow. This grass tastes pretty good. God dang it, not now, Jared, you bastard! Well, what is it, applesauce? Son of a bastard! This is a freaking nightmare. Is the landlord still not back? The question was rhetorical. I know we're still outside. We'll always be outside. We're gonna die out here. I'm hungry too, Applesauce. We're all hungry. We haven't eaten for hours. The only food we could ever have possibly eaten was the dragon. And it's like halfway across the field. Oh god, I'm so hungry. I'd do anything for food right now. Ah, uh, it's so nice to loiter in an abandoned property and just eat my lunch here. Ah! Applesauce, did you seriously just murder this guy so we could loot what's in his lunchbox? Good point, let's eat. It's a garbage can. It's salt. A garbage can is full of salt! Just how the hell are we gonna survive on salt?! Well then what the hell do we eat?! Wait, are we seriously going to cannibalize a guy? Okay, fine, let's eat them. Well, we just ate a guy. Well, I'm glad you're happy, Applesauce, because if I have to stay outside for any more than five more minutes, then I'm probably going to scream. Oh, thank God the good door lets open. Let's get it in there. Let's get in there and we'll never come back to this horrible place. 
Hello everyone, we are now back inside and I have never been happier in my entire life. The one question I have is where the hell was our landlord during all of this? I was right here watching you all fall into my plan. Wait, what, 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 where were you, and what, what plan are you talking about? Well, Barry, this show being the show that it is, I knew that at some point, I would eventually be killed off very violently. And so, I devised this plan in order to trade the life of that simpleton with a lunchbox full of salt and trash cans for my own. Yes, and it all went perfectly. So, are we just gonna ignore the fact that he made us eat a guy, or am I just going crazy? There is no sane or crazy here! This is my domain, and you're all my slaves! <laughs> ah! Ah, okay. Okay, let's... <laughs> Yeah, I'm pretty sure he has schizophrenia or something. I think he needs to get checked. Are we seriously just going to ignore the fact that we murdered a guy and ate him? Okay then.